manipulating an image with the puppet trap feature hello there in this video tutorial you will learn manipulating an image with the puppet trap feature of Adobe Photoshop CS6 we have the Photoshop application open here let's take an image to work on I'm taking this image Let's select the quick selection tool from the toolbar. Now I'm going to select the body area from this image here. You can see that the quick selection tool is automatically selecting the area here. Pressing Ctrl J, you can see the layer is getting separated. Let's hide the background layer. Now let's go to Edit menu and choose the Puppet Wrap option. The Puppet Wrap feature gives you flexibility in manipulating an image. You can reposition areas such as hair or an arm just as you might pull the strings on a puppet. You place pins where you want to control movement. You will use puppet wrap to tilt the model's head back so he appears to be looking up. With the model layer selected in the layers panel, a mesh appears over the visible areas in the layer. In this case, the mesh appears over the model. You will use the mesh to place pins where you want to control movement or to ensure there is no movement. Click around the edges of the shirt. Each time you click, Puppet Trap adds a pin. The pins you have added around the shirt will keep it in place as you tilt the head. Select the pin at the nape of the neck. A white dot appears in the center of the pin to indicate that it's selected. Press Alter. A larger circle appears around the pin and a curved double arrow appears next to it. Continue pressing Alter or Option as you drag the pointer to rotate the head backwards. You can see the angle of rotation in the Options bar. When you are satisfied with the rotation, click the Commit Puppet Wrap button in the Option bar or press Enter or Return. Save your work so far. Thank you.